Okay, so I did have to improvise this uh, 4x3 setup. When If we do do um, anything like this again... Actually, give me a second. I, don't th I think something's gone wrong there. I clicked the wrong thing. There we go. Okay, so welcome to Microsoft 3D Movie Maker. Released in 1995, um, it was a program released by Microsoft where you could release, where you could make your own move 3D movies uh, using the tool set they gave you. Uh, it did have an expansion pack released, well, two of them. Uh, one featuring characters from the Japanese anime Doraemon, which was only in the Japanese version of the Japanese version of the game. And one featuring Nickelodeon characters, which was basically a game all of its own. Uh, I played a lot. Uh, this is one of the first games I got with a new PC. Um, the other ones I remember are Rebel Assault 2, uh, the Magic School Boss uh, Goes to Space, uh, Jedi Knight, Rebel Assault 2. Uh, yep, yeah, okay. So... The idea of this is basically it's a 3D making movie, uh, 3D movie making tool. But I will, I'll let the intro run just so you can get a rough idea of what you're in for. Well, hello there. My name, if I may present myself, is McZ. Nice to finally meet you face to face. <laughs> oh my see. God, go this guy's creepy. The help machine. In case you have any, you know, movie making questions, etc. The portfolio, where we keep all of our magnificent work. The toolbox, so we have everything we need to make a sweet, cool movie. The talent book, so you can see all of the actors you can use in your movie. And let's see a few other things. <laughs> okay. Ooh, one more thing. You never know what's going to happen in an Iconopolis. So, if you ever need any help, just click me. I don't think we'll be doing that. Oh no. Who's there? Don't you recognize Super Z? No, 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 wait. I'm your amigo Carlos. <laughs> I don't know. I'm a cheesecake. Mm, I love cheesecake. I want to use that in everyday comment, gotcha. everyday oh, conversation. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I'm a cheesecake. Ah, one of the pages from the talent book. Hey, wherever you go, keep your eyes open for the rest of the pages, okay? They could be anywhere. McZee, are you coming? Uh, yeah, I'll be right there. Remember the carpet bag. <laughs> okay, thanks, Melanie. See you inside. So, yes, this little monstrosity is the um, mascot of this game, McZee. A purple dongle hair, dongle nose thing who serves as ticket booth guy, maitre d', film director, producer... Okay, what, okay what, is, what isn't this guy? When I was a kid, this guy gave me at least one nightmare. Hey, hello there. <laughs> Welcome to the theater. Would you like to see a movie or make a movie? You choose. I think we're going to make a movie. Hey, this way to the backstage. Uh-huh. Da-da-da-da! Here we are backstage. There's a ton of things you can do back here. If you're stuck for an idea, check out the splot machine or the talent book in the ideas room. If you're ready to make a movie of your own, you'll find all the tools you need in the studio. Hey, Melanie. Yo, Blue Boy. Giving another tour? Yeah, I was just about to say that the projects room is a great place to go if you want to make a flying is so logo. 90s. Yeah, and my other movie-making projects are fun, too. If you haven't made a movie before, this is a good place to start. What would you like to do now? So, what would you like to do? So, there's three things you can do. The door on the right will um, 
the woman on the rollerblades there, Melanie, she will take you through certain movie making techniques. If you're stuck for an idea of what to do with a film, you can go to the ideas room in the door on the left, and the door in front is the whole, where the whole magic happens, where you get to make your own movie. But we're not going to do that just yet. Now, there's one thing, remember when McZee said the talent book was lost? Uh, this That's the game part of this program. You will look click around, uh, finding different uh, pages on of his talent book. Um, can't even think what I was going to say now. Uh, before you ask, no, you don't get anything special for getting all of them. But you, um, I don't, cause I think I don't know if you can use the actors already when you find. I don't know if you can use the actors already, and you don't need to find the talent book pages for them. But I mean, it's something to do nonetheless. So, um. Why don't we have a nose in the ideas room first? All right. Hello. Hello, Hipster Migsy. Just leave him to his devices. Uh, that's nice. Oh, that's a keeper. <laughs> What's a keeper, Migsy? Uh, that's nice. Oh, that's a keeper. Okay, so let's have a look and see what uh, things we can find if we click on stuff. Thanks! I'll put this page back in the talent book. To see all the pages you've collected, look for the talent book in the ideas room. I don't know why a talent book page would be in a mop bucket, but hey. Why don't we click on Mig Z? Oh, hey, what's happening? You know, there's all kinds of ideas in here. If you want to see all the actors you can use in your movies, look at the talent book. If you want to see thousands of different ways you can start your very own masterpiece, play with the Splot Machine. What now? Okay, we're not going to do anything with either of those things yet. We're just going to have a look for more talent book pages. Thanks! I'll put this page back in the talent book. Thanks! I'll put this page back in the talent book. Thanks! I'll put this page back in the talent book. You're going to hear that a lot. Thanks! I'll put this page back in the talent book. Um, if you've already looked somewhere and you try and click it again, you'll just get this noise. Uh, this one? Thanks. I'll... Thanks. I'll put... Thanks. Thanks. I'll put this page back in the talent book. Okay. I think we've exhausted those, those avenues. Uh, Thanks! I'll put this page back in the talent book. To see all the pages you've collected, look for the talent book in the ideas room. Eliza lives in Cancun, Mexico, where the water is turquoise and clear. She is the oldest of nine children. When she isn't helping her mother in their store, she practices singing and dancing. Dream role, dream roles, hippie, nurse, and explorer. Oh, okay. Okay, those are nice roles to have. Uh, can we click on the lights here? Uh, nothing. Let's have a look at the splot machine before we get out of Great. here. Great! Let's whip up a movie! Hey, Whoa. Midi, how you doing? How you doing? We're playing a game from my childhood today. Uh, we've done a TRLE, which was good. I, uh, definitely want to play more of that if Delka's, uh, doing an AOD full game. Uh, this one is 3D Movie Maker, what I played when I was younger. Uh, we're just looking through the different features slowly. So if you pull this lever, I don't even know what context this is, but oh my god. If you want to work on this, you need to do, you use the toolbox over there. But we're not going to do that. Hold on, my TV is on standby. Okie dokie. How you doing anyway, Midi? You're okay. So, what would you like to do? Let's go see Melanie. Perfection! Alright, she'll teach you how to do a flying logo and movie techniques. But we'll just want to look around first and see if she's got any talent book pages on her. Thanks! I'll put this page back in the... Apparently we've got a mummy as an actor. Thanks! I'll put this page back in the... Uh, anything else? Thanks! I'll put this page back in the talent book! 
Uh, Migzy, you're not looking very hard for these talent book pages. Uh, sorry, Melanie. Thanks. I'll put this page back. Thanks. I'll put this, this page, page back. back Thanks. I'll put this page back in the talent book. Yeah. Thanks. I'll put this page back in the talent book. You might be thinking what possessed me to play this to get and play this on stream. Um because I was it was to do with a uh Twitter a Twitter quiz about games I played in 1995 and this was one of them and I found a um place where you can get it working on Windows 10 so I thought you know what? Why not give this a go for nostalgia's sake? Let's talk to Melanie. Hi, welcome to the project. You're mode. surviving, and if you. you want I'm to show okay. You how to make a flying logo, I hope you're doing. Flick the screen on the left. If you'd like to see some cool movie making well, techniques, keep it up, Mitty. You're doing good. Right. What would you like to do now? We're not going to do both of these. We're going to do one of them. We're going to do movie techniques. My project gadget will help you create six movies step by step. I've made part of each movie for you. Use my project gadget to help you do the rest. Okay. This project shows you how to create a conversation. To see the way the movie is supposed to look, click the play button. Okay. Destiny's Child intensifies. <laughs> I'll trade um. a magic trick for a vase. Oh, I don't know. I'll show you my best trick ever. Okay. You've got a deal. To see uh, the steps for making this movie, click the how button. Again, we're not going to do all of these. We're going to do one of them. I created the first part of the movie for you. Gregory just said, I'll trade a magic trick for a vase. Now it's your turn to add Claudia's talk action and dialogue. Okay. To find the talk action, click actions. Click Claudia. Uh-huh. Click the talk action. Click the OK button. Click Claudia. Then hold down the mouse button for as long as it takes Claudia's arms to move and end up by her side. When I wasn't expecting you to click there. What would you like to do? Um, I thought we were done. Okay. I wasn't expecting you to click there. What would you like to do? I wasn't expecting you to click there. Shut up. How long am I supposed to be doing this? Um, maybe not, but if you wanted to learn how to do dialogue. I wasn't expecting you to click there. What would you like to do? Go back to the project room, uh, get rid of the changes. Well, let's go to where the so, magic happens. Like let's go and make our own film. Again, sorry for the little creep known as McV. Now, he is supposed to be doing a tutorial here, but um, for some reason, my particular installation isn't doing anything. So, let's go with a scene. Um, okay, what kind of scene can we have here? Um, so far, we've got a street, we've got a building, we've got a cafe, we've got a, some resort place, the inside of a resort place. A cave, a castle, inside of a castle, castle dining room. You know what? I think we're going to do a cafe. Quick camera angles. Um, let's do, let's do talking at a table. Click actors. Now you can do use many actors supplied to you in the game. Um, here they all are. Don't they look like a happy bunch? Um, but you can also use in this in particular installation I've got Doraemon characters and Nickelodeon characters like uh, Ren and Stimpy characters from Rocco's Modern Life. Um, wherever these guy, wherever this guy's from, I can't remember for the life of me where he's from. Uh. You know what? Let's put... I can't even remember the specific characters of Rocco's Modern Life. I've seen it, but I can't remember the characters. So, let's put Ren here. Click on him. A 
Let's have him sit in. There we go. So he's... Wait, what is he doing? Okay. So, there's no sit and talk here, but there is but there is for the base game actors. Okay. This is going to be rather interesting to do. Uh, let's get let's do a human actor here. Uh, you. You look hipster enough. Uh, sit and talk. Where is that? Uh, sit, talk, stand. I guess that'll do. So, frame one. Let's do some sound, some dialogue. Uh... Oh. You idiot! You idiot! You idiot! You idiot! Let's just put it in over and over. You idiot! You idiot! You idiot! <laughs> okay. Let's give this guy something to say. How about... What is it, man? What is it, man? I know they sound the same, but... You idiot! You idiot! You idiot! <laughs> I don't even you know what idiot. I'm doing at the moment. <laughs> Better workflow than Premiere Pro. Is it that bad? Is Premiere Pro that bad? Uh... Yes, that's it. Ooh, this place is spooky. Ooh, this place is spooky. You idiot! <laughs> you idiot! You, some people might be able to make the animations you a bit idiot. more fluid than I would, but... This place is spooky. Okay, that's one scene. Uh, let's do a city street. Um, I don't know. Let's have this guy running out of the cafe. Uh, which one is this? Let's uh, run scared. There we go. Let's go back to the first frame. And then just have him chasing him. Can Ren run? Yes, he can. Um... Oh my god, this is actually working. I sank loads of hours into this playing this as a kid. I'm a bit surprised I did now. You idiot! You idiot! You idiot! You idiot! Ooh, this place is spooky. <laughs> Okay, I can roll with that. I can roll with that. Let's have um, this guy. <laughs> I don't know. Did anybody watch Ren and Stimpy when they were younger? I mean, I saw bits of it, but I was more into cow and chicken. Okay, let's put Ren. Let's put Ren here. Uh, 
Falling bushes sound effect. You idiot! You idiot! Okay, and then let's... Let's make him run as well. Okay. You idiot! Now uh, go to the next, go to the last scene. You idiot! <laughs> What's this poor man done to incur the wrath of Ren? I don't know. I don't even know. Uh, let's see. Where can uh, where can they go now? Uh, how about the bathroom? Let's see. Let's see if this scene I've got an idea for can, uh, alright, is there a sneaking option? No, well, there's crawling. Okay, he's crawling to the bathroom, and then just to have Ren off camera. You, you fat bloated sack of, you fat bloated sack. Okay, and then have Patrick running away. So frame 51 this is. Actually wait, no, 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 no. Go back, go back a few frames. Let's see how this scene looks for the lols. You fat bloated sack of protoplasm! <laughs> what even the hell is this? If anybody's got any suggestions for scenes, you're welcome to shout it out. If we can do them. Oh my word. I don't even know what the hell this is anymore. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. So how about... Why don't we move to... A plane... And then, let's have him sit in. Uh, sit, talk, stand, there we go. Let's see, what other actors can we put in there? Put Stimpy in there. Uh, let's have him sit down as well. Uh, who else can we put in? Um, you. You. You'll do. Uh, these guys can just be in the background doing whatever. This guy can do the boogie, boogie, woogie, woogie. And then... 
No, that's a bit creepy. You idiot! What are you doing? What are you doing? And then it's like, oh shit. And this guy just runs away. Uh, where's Ren? There he is. I'm turning Ren into a little bit of a psychopath, aren't I? Uh. You fat bloody. <laughs> you. Stimpy! Shut up, you fool! There we go. Shut up, you fool! Have him run, run around, run around after him. Put it back over here. What are you doing? Shut up, you fool! <laughs> Oh my god, this is too much. This is so funny. Does anybody have anybody have any suggestions? I'm all I'm all ears. So we have, we should have a big fight next, I think. Uh, let's go over here. Um. Don't even know what the hell to call this movie. So we can karate kick. Now, while I'm here, the Nickelodeon um, movie maker, I didn't play it when I was younger. But from what I remember, it is a lot more limited than what this one is. Um, only certain areas were accessible. And um, you can only do the theater, the studio, and... Um, the ideas room, I think. I think that was it. You idiot! You idiot! <laughs> okay, let's uh, make him fall. What in all seventeen of different hells is this? Hey, Sam, this is a. Uh, this is 3D Movie Maker. This is 3D Movie Maker where you get to make your own movies. Actually, you know what? I'll save the movie and we're going to watch it. Type the name of your movie. If you make a mistake, press the backspace key. When you're done, click the OK button. Just call it, why is this a thing? And then you get to go... Oh, actually, let's uh, go to the lobby first. Nah! <laughs> Ciao, welcome to the lobby. Go away. Mmm, buttered popcorn. Uh, Peter yeah, straight ahead, snack bar is on your right. Yeah, Sans, I used to play this game a lot as a kid. I've only just rediscovered it recently. So while we're here, we're going to be looking for talent book pages. Thanks. I'll put this page back in the talent book. Now, as far as I remember, I think the talent book pages give Thanks. you the option to I'll use the actors. I'll put this page back in the talent but I th oh, you can use them from the off. I can't remember one hundred percent. Let's see. But you don't get anything special for finding all of them. Uh, no one was up so here. Oh, you like to do. I'll put this page. Hello, Migzy. Yes, this fresh little blue bastard is Migzy. The um, mascot Microsoft thought this would be appropriate for that would be appropriate for kids uh, get your popcorn ice cream hot dogs candy yes thanks i'll put this pa how did a talent book page get in the get in the candy display thing mystery uh anything else we need to click on in here no oh actually hold on whoops i 
I've got two displays on at once here, and I keep clicking the wrong one. Right, let's so, go to the theatre. Like <laughs> Exordium ST Omnis Immude Spiritus Omnida Satanica Podesta. Would you like to see a movie? <laughs> <laughs> Omni Satanica Potestas, Omni Incursa, Incursion Fenderless Adversity. Now go away, creepy purple thing. He's here to stay. Let's watch this movie we made. Select the name of the movie you want to open. When you're done, <laughs> click the OK button. Yeah, um, as a kid, I had at least one nightmare to this guy. I'm sure many people will probably believe that. Now, it's a bit awkward with this because... Um, for some reason, this game, at least the installation I did, doesn't save your movies in the game directory. You need to go to your documents. Okay, why is this a thing? Okay. You found the weird creatures in the first Spy Kids movie less creepy. You idiot! You idiot! You idiot! Ooh, this place is spooky. I don't know why he's pissed off Ren, he just has. You idiot! <laughs> oh my god. Now he needs to go to the bathroom. You feel like you just tripped on all the things at once. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> you fat bloated sack of protoplasm! <laughs> oh my god. Okay, now he's on a plane. Somebody's doing a dance. What are you doing? Shut up, you fool! <laughs> oh my god. Truly a movie worthy of 2021, I know, right? <laughs> okay, that's a bit creepy. Ah! Hey, that was excellent. What should we do now? <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Let's go and work on this movie a little bit more. Or do we want to work on this movie more or do we want to make a new one? Is this a perfect masterpiece as it is? I'll give it a minute and then I'll decide for myself. Thus far, everything you have seen makes you want to gouge out your eyeballs. <laughs> oh, come on, it's not that bad. <laughs> Maybe worse, but not that bad. <sighs> okay. You know what, I think we might try and create another one just before we leave things off for tonight. Like a genuinely serious one. Like a serious attempt at somebody trying to make a movie with this thing. Hey, oh, this way to the backstage. Oh, you yeah, that is creepy. Stop that. Ready to create a movie of your very own? You just use the tools in the studio to make a great movie. Okay. All right. Let's uh what are we going to call this movie? Come on, I'll, I'll let the chat decide. What are we going to call this movie? We're going to use this background, I've decided. Because we get does this, mo cause this tool does let you use flying text. <laughs> okay. I mean, the modding community behind this, from what I've seen, there is, there is a community here that is still going, and it's still... They're still making movies and making mods for this. Move this here. There we go. And just, uh... Yeah, I think that is okay. 
you know what? I think we're going to call it. Uh, how's that? We'll call it the chat's worst nightmare. Would I say that was accurate? Okay, let's see if we can put this in different colours. Uh, a bit of brown. Remember, remember those um, editing programs from the nineties? Yeah. Okay. Um, leave the cat out when you go to bed. They'll bring them in. All right. Okay. That's fine. Okay. So let's do Guild Sans Ultra Bold. You know those things. You know, like in the nineties, or people have used Microsoft Word way back when. You know when you put something together for a school report and you get these fancy logos and uh, clip art things like that. This is what this reminds me of. Okay, let's put this uh, put this back here. Uh, hide it up here. No. Walk forward. Cartwheel. Let's have it do the wave. And then wave back around, and then back again. Okay, so I think we'll do a haunted house. Uh, yeah, that is perfect. Uh, let's see. Uh, this could be an interesting camera angle. Um, let's see. What actor can we use for this? Um. Um. Uh, you. You look vaguely serious. Let's say maybe he's sneaking into this place late at night. Because he's... Ah, nightmare creature number six. Yes, exactly. Yeah, they do all look a bit odd. Okay. So let's do inside the house. With this guy just coming in and just wondering what the hell is going on. Let's walk slowly. Let's use a bit of background music, I think. Uh, let's see. Perfect. Hmm, okay. Let's wander in here. And then, where did he go? Uh, let's see. Let's see what other camera angles we've got in here. Oh, that could work. Let's do a little uh, secret lab. But let's walk fast. Because he wants to get to the bottom of this. That sounds like an RPG victory thing. Also, the engine this game's re rendered on was developed by Argonauts. Um, I can't remember what... <coughs> 
you have this issue where you watch videos about a subject you have some personal investment in and then get angry because the thing the creator of the video is disgusting is so stupid it pisses you off what subject is that sans oh let's get tense Oh, music doesn't work with actors, only with backgrounds. Yes, okay. Uh, let's say this is a secret lab. Bring him in here. And then he can have, we can have an actor like the mad scientist. He could just be doing a boogie for no real reason. He's doing a dance. I'm sure you can put your own voices to this, but I wouldn't know how to do that from here. Uh, I think it might have to be edited separately. I'm not too sure. Okay. What's that one? Okay, so that motion um, syncs up a sound effect to an actor. Okay. So. You saw a video now about a guy discussing an article stating an atheist means you lack purpose and unable to find happiness and fulfillment in life. Guy making the video disagrees, but just hearing the things in the article actively annoys me. I can see that. I mean, for somebody's personal happiness, that does have to come from you within yourself. I mean, it doesn't mean latching on to specific things. Um, so, yeah, I would, dis I would disagree with that, too. I mean, if you're an, a if you're an atheist, then... Uh, I'm sure there's something else in there that does make you happy, but I just, uh, yeah, I can see why I can see why that would rile you up um, in a way. Let's try the record your own funk own thing and see what that does. Okay. <laughs> I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. Life in plastic, it's fantastic, you can brush my hair, and, <laughs> okay, let's do it. I'm a Barbie girl, in a Barbie world, life in plastic. It's become a, it's gonna become a scuff sound. Can brush my hair. <laughs> I can barely hear that, I don't even, oh, you know what, throw it in anyway. Okay, let's do let's try that again, shall we? <laughs> um not that one. Let's see if we can do this like proper opera. Okay, let this uh let me see if I can move the microphone a little bit closer. Um let's try something else. I'm a Bobby girl in a Bobby world. Rapping plastic. It's fantastic. You can rush my hair. <laughs> Um, the microphone on Streamlabs is peaking, so whether that picks up in game, I don't know. I'm a Bobby girl. That's louder. Okay. Okay. Yeah, let's give it to this guy. I'm a Bobby girl. <laughs> oh my god oh my god <clears throat> fun thing in pokemon diamond pearl and platinum the pokemon chat bar or chatter i think i've read that right has a unique attack where you can record your voice into and that is the sound played during the attack the thing is the louder where you where you are when recording your voice the higher the chance the attack can views of the enemy so what you can just swear at a pokemon and just damage it or something uh Uh, 
uh, you can't really hear me over the music in the game, but okay, we're gonna we'll roll with that. We'll roll with it. Uh, hmm. Uh, let's try that again. Let's try that again. <clears throat> uh, let's see. Mm. Rumor has it you've been experimenting on people here and turning them into some weird thing. And I want to find out why. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Oh, one second. Right, okay, let's carry on then and just say that's, um, let's call that Expo 1, or just Expo. Uh, does that maybe sync up properly? Well, we'll find out in a minute. Let's do another one. You talk too much. Shut up. Okay? Okay? Good. Okay, call that there. You talk. I know you can't hear the dialogue, but... Mm. Let's do that while dancing. Okay. And now the big plot twist. He finds out what they've been working on. And then... Boom. Let's go! <laughs> Luigi Sorchin, I know, right? <laughs> uh, and then... Let's do the grow feature, because this... That... Okay. Okay. Who says you can't learn anything from anime? You know what a spider means you to anime? Oh, no. I, yeah, a spider chin is basically Spanish for um, swordsman, if I remember correctly, from what I remember from my... Uh, when I was doing my research, when doing my um, OC character. Okay. Let's see how this looks on screen. Save that. Oh wait, no, that's a help machine. Type the name of your movie. If you make a mistake, press the backspace key. When you're done, click the OK button. Okay, I know the dialogue's gonna be muffled, but you know what? Let's do it. This is what you'd imagine. <laughs> yeah, get rid of them before closing the movie. This is what I imagine Satan's hungover fever nightmares look like. Select the name of the movie you want to open. When you're done, click the OK button. OK, 
Okay, need to... You get a tour of my PC here, which isn't good. Oh, I didn't do music for that, did I? Okay, come on. What is he going to find? Sounds like a pissed Batman dancing in the corner. You can't hear me, I'm drowned out by the music. Excellent. What should we do now? All right. Okay. I'm gonna get. Come on, a... let's. I'm just gonna get a couple of things in the in the theater. Thanks. I'll put. For a minute there, I thought McZ said "fuck off." Thanks. I'll put this page back in the talent book. To see all the pages you've collected, <laughs> look for the talent book in the ideas room. You forgot the demon Phineas is a thing. Sebastian is fifth. I think that says 15, yes it does, and loves baseball more than anything. Most of the time he plays sandlot games with friends from school, but he dreams of becoming a professional baseball player in a few years. Dream roles, trick or treater, dress as an alien, pizza delivery boy, and boy scout. None of this sounds like he wants to be an actor. McZe, are you just going around the world kidnapping people in your carpet bag and making them be in your movies? At this point, that wouldn't surprise me. Okay, I want to see if there's any more talent book pages in here somewhere. I'm just going to let that sit. I'm just going to let that sit for a minute. Enjoy your nightmares tonight. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> We're just going to tab over for a minute. <laughs> oh god. Okay. So, what would you like There's to do? There's one more thing I want to do, and we'll stop, and we'll stop here. <laughs> Bingo! Fine, put me through. I'm trying to thanks. put together a deal. Okay. I'll put this bag. Okay, that's, uh... Thanks! I'll put this... Thanks! I'll put this... If anybody's wondering what the hell I'm doing, uh, at the beginning of the game, Big Z lost his, um... Pages of actor resumes in the talent book, and for some reason they've ended up scattered all over the studio, and you got to find them Thanks. all. Thanks. I'll put this page back. And uh, before anybody asks, no, you don't get anything special for do getting Thanks. all of them. Thanks. I'll put this page back in the talent book. To see all the pages you've collected, look for the talent book in the ideas room. Kim is supposed to be a quiet, proper, twelve-year-old Japanese girl who behaves herself. Wrong. Kim wiggles constantly, will try anything once, and really wants to be a kid stunt actress. Eh? That's just weird. Thanks! I'll put this page back in the talent book. To see all the pages you've collected, look for the talent book in the ideas room. Okay, I think we've got everything we need. So I'm just going to get out of here and we are going to go and raid somebody. Okay, now then, any... You are so excited for Krauss Warn. 
Crow's Warn, sorry, is a game like a mix of Hollow Knight and Bloodborne based on the trailer. Ooh, ooh, that sounds nice. If you want to dump the trailer in the Discord server, I wouldn't mind taking a gander at that myself. Um, any music during the stream, as per usual, is taken from the album Imagined by Nicholas Judy via the Dark Fantasy Studio. So, uh, if you do exclamation mark music, you can find a link where you can download this music to your heart's content. Uh, let's see if I can put that in the chat. There we go. Okay, so, who can I go and send you off to? Uh... Let's see. Let me just open Twitch for two seconds. Um, we will be back streaming tomorrow. Uh, we're going to be doing Sonic Heroes tomorrow. It's something I've been wanting to do for a little while. Uh, let's see. Ah, uh, heck. Heck. Alright. Okay. Working with two mice. Bear with me. I can send you to... Why don't I send you over to Cuvo, who's doing Horizon Zero Dawn? And uh, we'll go and see what he's up to, shall we? Okay, so th thank you for everyone who came in and supported the stream. Thank you, DJ Full, for the raid earlier. Um, so yeah, we will go and say hi to Cuvo. Um, again, thank you so much, everyone, for watching. And I will see you again next time. Ta-ra for now.